Alright guys, we're doing Billy Joel's Still Rock and Roll to Me, one of my favorite songs of all time. What's the matter with the clothes I'm wearing? Can't you tell that your tie's too white? Maybe I should buy some more time. Uh, I forgot the words. Nothing I suppose. Tab collars, welcome back to the age of jive. And then so forth. Alright, uh... The whole lesson, the lesson for the whole song can be found on webpianoteacher.com. Uh, but let's do this free part one here. We're going to start with uh, left hand. And what I did, I actually am giving you several options here. Um, I'm writing the, the bass line here, and then I'm putting the chords on top. Because you kind of hear a guitar in there somewhere. And then I put the melody up on top there so in case you want to do the melody so I'm going to give you some options to do here alright but anyway the, the muted guitar sound that we hear at the beginning is just a C note and you can either do an octave because that kind of fills it out or you can just do the single note I think the octave sounds best so let's do that um, and I think we're going to do it 16 I didn't do that in the, at the beginning but how about 16 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 Actually, it'd be uh, 32. So 32 times. And we're going to swing it. Bop, 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 bop. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30. Or you can count to uh, 16 two times, of course, instead of 32. But then when we start singing... What's the matter with the clothes I'm wearing? Can't you tell that your tie's too wide? Okay, so we're going to put these uh, right hand chords in here. And, and again, uh, it's a transcription. There's no piano in it there. Um, so we're, we're just kind of trying to make it sound like, you know, the, everything together. So we have to uh, do some things to make it sound, sound good on piano. So... Um, Let's do E and G and C above middle C. That'll be our chord. And then we're going to change chords here to E, G, B. And then we're going to change chords to D, F, B flat. And then we're going to change chords to C, F, A. And I'm just going to hold it. I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. See how the left hand plays 8 C octaves? And then we change here and then we do 8 E octaves. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then we're going to change to D, F, and B flat. And the left hand's going to play a B flat octave eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So B flat octave. And then C, F, A. Left hand's going to do an F octave eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now that is when the singing starts. When the singing starts, that's when we start the A, the eight times. Whenever at the beginning, you know, you start that 32 times, and then you come in, you play. What's the matter with the clothes I'm wearing? Can't you tell that your tie's too white? Okay, and uh, then we're going to start over and do it again. Maybe I should buy some more tab collars. Welcome to the age of jive. Okay, so we just repeat that uh, for the verse. Okay, so you start with the C, 32 times, I didn't put that on there, should have, I guess. Uh, and then we'll start the... Now, if you like, if you want to try this, you can try the um, right hand melody, which, let's do that. So this is not something else that you're going to play with all this, this is just another option. Let's look at the melody first. I just wrote the melody out. Some people like to play the melody in the right hand instead of singing it. But uh, so I, I went ahead and I'm showing you that, and I continue to show you in the rest of the lessons on webpianoteacher.com if you're a member. But uh, let's do the, the melody. C five times. One, two, three, four, five, then up to a D, then a B, A, A, two times on the A, G two times, and then E, and then B flat four. One, two, three, four, and then C once. And then A, G, F. So, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, is the melody. Now, if you want to play the left hand down here, this, 
and this and leave the middle out. You can do that. You can go. Okay, I just I just fit the melody in there. Now, let me do it really slow you slow for you so you can see what I'm doing. I'm doing the bottom here and the very top here. Here we go. something else you can do. If you're really <clears throat> brave, you can try to combine all three parts. And what you do as you play this, you're going to do the, the chord on the bottom. See how you have the C? Well, you can, you can combine that with this chord. And then you combine this with this chord. And then you can combine this. D, F, B flat. One, two, three, four, and then C. Da -da -bum. That's hard to land to go. Da -da. And then play the F. A and C together, but we're just combining the two, so you'd have Okay, if you want, then you put the left hand with it, you'd have Okay, so you'd have that. Now if you're going to sing it, all you want to do is this What's the matter with the clothes I'm wearing? Can't you tell that that's too white? Okay, if you want to do a sort of a piano solo, then you can do either just this or try to combine the right hand on that too. Okay, or you can do... That's it for the, the free part one. Hope you enjoy it. Check out my website at webpianoteacher.com, and I'll talk to you guys later.